What's up guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new video and in this tutorial I'm going to show you guys exactly where to find the awesome VFX footage for your videos. So let's say that you're looking for transitions, for buttons and icons, for backgrounds, for lower thirds, anything like that. I found an amazing website and that's also our sponsor for today. So a big shout out to Production Crate for sponsoring this video and you can also find a link in the description and you can go ahead and check it out. So I'm just going to click on connect with Google so I can just go ahead and log in. It says you're in, you can now access thousands of HD production goodies to amp up your videos and that's what exciting what we're going to do today okay so they got me this link and as you can see right now it brings us to motion graphics so let's say that you're looking for an amazing uh, transition for example this is looking very very nice we have four previews okay so as you can see those are a few uh, very cool transitions that you can use in your project so let's see and let's go ahead and look uh, what else we got we have awesome backgrounds as you can see uh, those are just four previews you can just click on backgrounds and it will take you to the page where you have tons of more of backgrounds and at the bottom as you can see we have a lot of um, lower thirds as well so how this works is let's say that we're going to go ahead and download this transition so we're going to go ahead and click on it and obviously you can just go ahead and choose a subscription and then you can upgrade to a pro account and then you can just have access to all those footage so when you upgrade your account as you can see right now it says you can choose your format i'm going to pick uh, mp4 and i'm going to click on download and as you can see it's downloading straight away and it's not that you're going to see like the production crate logo because if i go ahead and play this video back this is how it looks like it is just a green screen and then the orange transition happens that's how you do it as you can see if i go ahead and uh, make it a little bit bigger this is how the transition looks so that looks really, really amazing. So let's go ahead and use this one into our project. So I'm going to go to Vegas and I'm going to go ahead and drag in a solid color. That means that I'm going to uh, put in a random color and I'm going to show you guys how to apply that transition that we just downloaded from production. Great. So I'm going to go ahead and scroll down until we find solid color. I'm going to pick, for example, the color red. And I want to go ahead and make that transition to blue. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to also drag in a blue image. Then what we're going to do is we're going to drag in the, uh, the video that we just downloaded. So that's what we're going to do. So as you can see, this is the clip. But we want to have the green removed because we want to have make it make it transparent. So we're going to go to the uh, video effects tab. And we're going to go ahead and pick the chroma key right here. And I'm going to drag in the default one on top of the clip we're going to uncheck this for a second we're going to click on the little uh, box we're going to pick this pencil icon we're going to pick the nice green color and i'm going to just re-enable the chroma key again this is now our transition complete be being completely transparent so if i go ahead and make a new video track and i put it over it this is what it looks like Boom, and now you can go ahead and switch to the blue one. So what you also can do is go ahead and download the MOV file, drag it into Vegas, right click on it, properties, you wanna go ahead and click on media, and you wanna put the alpha channel to straight unmatted. And as you can see right now, it is completely transparent. So this is basically how to use this amazing transition, like this. And if you don't want to have it like boom, like, you know, that's that's cutting it off. You can also duplicate this one and you can right click and you click on reverse. So this is basically how it looks like, what it looks like if we duplicate this one and if we reverse the second clip. So that's a really, really awesome transition. As you can see right now, it is going into the orange and then it goes back again. And that's how to create this awesome transition from production crate. And it's just very, very simple. Okay, so as you can see, we're back on the website. And like I said, we have so many different other transitions and it works exactly the same. You just wanna go ahead and uh, apply the green chroma key and now you can go ahead and use it. So that's amazing. We also have backgrounds that you can download if you want to go ahead and show something. You have like a nice background and also at the bottom we have lower thirds let's go ahead and click on lower thirds for a second and let's see what else we have we have really awesome lower thirds as you can see they're all animated for you so let's go ahead and click th download this one so i'm going to click on there we're going to choose our mp4 format this lower third and we're going to also drag that into vegas okay guys this is the lower third we're going to go ahead and apply the chroma key on top of it because we want to be uh we want to have that background color to be transparent like so and if i play it back this is what the lower third looks like 
So that's really cool, and you can just go ahead and apply and, and you know enter your text. So we go to the media generator tab, titles and text. We're gonna pick the default one, drag it on top of our track, and now we can we can just type in anything we want. So I'm going to go ahead and type in my YouTube name, which is just Alex Halford, obviously. If I go ahead and look for it now, it is a little bit too big, so I'm gonna place it. I'm gonna make it like uh, make it fit on the screen like that. So if I go ahead and type in my name like this. This is basically how you do that. So we can go ahead and also make a little nice fade in like this. So this is what it looks like. And we can also make it fade out. So that's amazing guys, this is how you add in a transition, how you use that, this is how to make a lower third. So that is basically it for this video. I'm not going to show you guys all the other stuff because otherwise this video would be like 30 minutes long because they have so many awesome clips. So that's it guys, make sure to check out Production Crate. If you guys like what you saw, you can find awesome transitions to spice up your videos. So that's it for this video, I want to thank you for watching. Also big thanks to Production Crate for sponsoring this video. And I'll see you guys obviously probably in the next live stream that's going to be tomorrow, the Sunday, January the 14th. So that's going to be amazing, so I will see you guys in the next video.